Hello, my friends. Well, you know me, I do a lot of radio reviews online through the channel. And, of course, I've been doing electronics probably since the 70s. One thing that's always going to stand out in the middle of all of this, very important thing to have, is always going to be your multimeter. This is the one I use. Let's take a look at it. Let's review it. And I'll tell you why I use it. So multimeters are an important piece of equipment. Very basic and standard equipment from anybody that works with radios or any kind of electronics. And there's a multitude of variety of models out on the market starting from hundreds of dollars um, professional grade multimeters that you have to really learn how to use but cost a lot of dollars. You can get uh, again pro grade electrician multimeters for checking uh, amp powers like this clamp meter. You can get really cheap ones which you still kinda have to turn on and select the mode you want to be in and then you have to know where you're going and you have to read it sometimes you have to move your probes from one side to the next you can get it halfway middle of the road nice little multimeters again a lot of information but a lot of settings that you have to do and do and then all of a sudden Tessman sent me this unit and asked me to review it for them and I thought sure why not? I'll check it out. I use them all the time. I obviously need multimeters all around. I do a lot of electronic work, so I thought, why not? I was immediately impressed. So much so that I'm doing a an unboxing on this. I never do unboxing videos, but I'm doing an unboxing on this radio. So let me show you that, and I'll come back to this really quick. Well, for those of you that watch my videos, you know I hate to do unboxings. I don't normally do unboxings. So why am I doing an unboxing on this one? Why is this different? Well, because I was really impressed. The packaging was impressive and more than anything else, the way it came was really quite impressive and definitely worth the unboxing. So the manual is extremely well presented very informational, comes in multiple languages, very high quality print, quality binding, not just a piece of paper like you usually get. Very, very nice manual. Carry case that comes in, all together there for you. And this, to me, probably has to be one of the most impressive things. Normally most of these things come with some little cheapy, cheapy zinc alloy batteries. Not this unit, folks. This actually came with genuine Duracell batteries. All included so you don't have to go out and buy them. Nice unit. Very nicely packaged. Excellent feel in the hand. Very nice. Probes come in a separate case on the side the little pocket for it. So overall I was so impressed with the way this thing was packaged that I had to do a quick unboxing on it. Anyway, let's get to the review and actually see what we have here. So having done that, now I want to come back to this and take a look at this unit and see why is it so nice and why do I really like it and prefer it to a lot of those other multimeters that I have. Well, one of the things that I like about this is this is completely auto. You notice there's not a whole lot you have to do. You don't have to push buttons. You don't have to do any settings. You want to check AC? Plug it into AC and get a reading. You want to check a battery? Which is, again, something most of us will do pretty much all the time. Just get your battery. Whether it's DC or AC, it doesn't really matter. Set your probes to it. There's your reading. 7.68 volt right away. Don't have to do anything with it. Don't have to test don't have to mess around with it. And we have batteries in everything we do. From little 
rechargeables to disposable batteries and any electronics. Continuity, another thing we always want to check. All you got to do, test the two of them together. Little LED comes on to let you know. You have your continuity and you get your beep. No settings required. You don't have to do anything. You don't, you don't have to move anything. You don't have a knob to switch. Just pull it right out, turn it on, start using it right away. That's very nice. That's an amazing feature on a little unit like this. It is nice. It is handy and portable. You saw the little case it came in. It comes with its own little carry case. So you always have it with you. It's protected from your rest of your tools that you have in your bag. Okay? And it has the silicone cover on the outside to protect the actual case. The quality is very good on it. But it has additional features that even some of my better ones don't have. Um, this one has a sensing mode. If you just put it up to an electric outlet right here, it will read and tell you whether it's hot or not. So again, you don't need to... I have separate testers for that. I don't need to. Not anymore. With this, I have it all there. It's right there. Also, you can have a light to actually light up your panel. So if you're working in the dark, you can see what you're doing. But an added bonus, which is really kind of cute on this, this actually has a built-in flashlight on the back. So if you need to work on a panel in the dark or something and there's no light around or no electricity, that's the way to go. So it's a nice little package. Probes are very solid. Silicone wire throughout. Again, case, automatic, good visibility and it'll always indicate what you're looking at. It'll show you whether you're doing voltage in DC, AC, if it's an audio connection or if you're measuring for ohms. So, the best part of this is you can pick this up on Amazon for less than $12. Yes, you heard me right. That's less than $12. For this grade of multimeter, less than $12, that's cheaper than most stuff you can get from the Far East that won't even do as many features as this thing will do. I will have a link below to link to this so you can get your own if you want to. Now, there's only one thing that I didn't really care for too much for the quality and the grade of this unit and for how well this is manufactured and how effective and efficient it is. I didn't really care too much for the silicone case. I don't know if it's the molding or the material. It might even be the color that's putting me off. I don't know. But I just think that it could be a little bit better. I'd probably pay an extra dollar or two if it were a little bit better case, it had a better feel in the hand. It's a little too, I don't know, too cheap feeling. Because the unit does not. If you take the cover off, the unit feels pretty good in the hand. But that little plasticky thing, not so much. Anyway, that's all I wanted to go over with you on this thing. It's, again, I highly recommend it. It's not because Tesman sent me this unit for testing. It is because I really like it and I really use it. As a matter of fact, here's what I'm going to do. Um, let's go to the comments. Send me a comment. I like this multimeter and I want one because, and fill in the blank. And when this video gets 200 likes, I will pick somebody at random and I'll send you a brand new multimeter like this one. Not this one. This one's mine. I will send you another one in the box, sealed, for you to use and enjoy. So, please, subscribe. Leave comments. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Like. And I'll be putting more of these up. Thanks for watching.